I would like to UN Secretary General. Mr. Secretary General, it is with heavy heart and utter depression that I write this letter to you. As a young man of 21st century, I feel disappointed and traumatized with wars and violence that continue to torment and afflict me and my fellow youths around the planet. We thought this century would have been the most civilized, organized and stabilized. However, it seems the pursuit of universal peace and security is still an illusion. We are in limbo. Today I do not know any prospect that the future holds for my generation. All that I know is that we are the victims of violence and wars masterminded by bloodthirsty brigands. We are massacred by people who have no sympathy and empathy for us. We are the victims of monumental conspiracy crafted and carved by people we do not know. The youths, the children, and the women of 21st century are suffering from conflicts and wars we do not make any sense to us. Before coming to this world and even at the time of birth, our beacon of hope was United Nations. We heard that great wars ravaged this world. We heard that millions of people died during the Second World War and then UN was created. We heard that the United Nations inherited the leaks of nations. We heard that the leak was inefficient and the Second World War broke out. We heard that at the conference of San Francisco on the 24th October 1945, solemn promises were made and the UN Charter signed. Unfortunately, these promises are futile. Unfortunately, the founding fathers of the UN have turned to become predators. The UN, the spirit of the UN is a paradox. All these violence and wars are happening in the life and time of global organizations that came with unequivocal purpose of maintaining international peace and security, developing friendly nation relations among nations, and promoting social progress, better living standards, and human rights. Unfortunately, United Nations disappointed my generation. Unfortunately, United Nations has failed woefully. I wish we have a global organization that will relieve us from these horrors and sorrows of wars and violence. The world needs peace. I wish we have a United Nations which is indeed united, not divided. Every day, everywhere and every time, terrible stories of conflicts and violence of different intensities greet us. Russia and Ukraine are on a war that is indeed a threat to human survival. United Nations cannot end this. On your visit to Ukraine, Mr. Secretary General, I heard you say UN has done everything possible, but it couldn't end the Ukraine-Russia crisis. Then, what is the purpose of UN? UN came with great assurance that universal peace will be guaranteed. Today, UN is saying that she cannot resolve a conflict started by her founder. Oh, UN, do you deserve the name UN? Mr. Secretary General, Syria, Afghanistan, Yemen, Libya, Iraq, Sierra Leone, Sudan, Democratic Republic of Congo are devastated by wars in the life and time of United Nations. What is the purpose of UN? Mr. Secretary General, Rwanda, Cambodia, Palestine, Sudan, Bosnia, Myanmar have witnessed atrocious genocides. In the era of UN, what has the UN done? What is the purpose of UN if she cannot resolve conflicts and wars? UN has once again proved to be irony of its fundamental purpose. Is UN following the trajectory of League of Nations? Where is the world heading to? We are homeless, hopeless, and sleepless due to wars and conflicts that continue to devastate humanity. We are tired of hearing your comments. We are tired of hearing your tweets. We need your accents if you really care for we the innocent youths, women and children. Oh Mr. Secretary General, let the UN rise. Oh Mr. Secretary General, our in our generation is innocent. Oh Mr. Secretary General, we are civilized. We do not want wars and violence. We need peace for our progress and prosperity. Tell the UN General Assembly, they failed my generation. Tell United States of America, they failed my generation. 
Tell United Kingdom they failed my generation. Tell France they failed my generation. Tell China they failed my generation. Tell Russia they failed my generation. Tell AU we have no hope on them. Whilst I look forward to your reply, I return to my state of depression created by your wars and aggression. Oh Mr. Secretary General, we are the victims of your wars.